We are here on the first impressions cam with Daniel Auken, director, now the Tony-winning director of Stereophonic on Broadway. Uh, how did it feel when they said your name out loud? Uh, I won't lie, it felt pretty great. <laughs> pretty great. Is it surreal? Do you kind of, uh, what do you think about as you're walking up to the stage? I, um, I, uh, I, uh, uh, you, the, that was it. That, I got it. Yeah, exactly. That was, it. that was a very accurate. <laughs> this whole uh, show, the whole process of, of, of this show, putting it together, you were saying to me earlier uh, what it took to uh, put it all together. When you reflect back on it now and you look at this, uh, does, it, does it feel different? Does it feel more exciting? Does it, what, are you, what are you feeling about this whole process up till now? Uh, you know, we just we made something we all believed in and we were really excited about. Being on Broadway was not on anybody's bingo card, and so all of this just feels like volcanically wonderful and and, and, a, and a, just a huge amount of process and just extremely satisfying. How did that moment happen where it was decided that it was going to go to Broadway from you were at Playwrights Horizons? We were at Playwrights Horizons, and it was about a month before the run ended, and uh, and uh, we'd met with some producers who we thought who under really understood the show. And uh, they met with us, and we, we all decided to march forward together. One of the things that's most astounding to me is that it's bringing in an audience that doesn't normally come to the theater. It's brought, bringing in people who love music, rock and roll. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> that, what does that mean to you when it's reaching people, an audience that does not normally come to the theater, Broadway? It's so exciting. I mean, I think uh, it's, it's, it's a play that's unlike any play that I've ever seen on, and certainly worked on. And I think it's really great for Broadway to have new and unusual things yeah. that uh, bring in new audiences and expand the possibilities of what can happen on a stage. Talk about the people you work with. A few of them have won Tony Awards already tonight. Yes. Uh, tell me about your your uh, your ensemble of artists, both on stage and behind the scenes. Uh, it, it, it really feels like a family. Uh, a number of the, a, a bunch of the design team have been with the show for seven or eight years, which is very unusual. Some of them before even a word was written. Uh, which is also very unusual, uh, not even to be recommended, I don't think, but it made sense in some weird way for this show. And uh, a number of the actors have been doing workshops of this show for seven or eight years. So it just feels like we've slowly built this team, this company of people who uh, all wanted to see this happen together. And uh, uh, it does, it feels like, it feels like a family. It's an astounding piece of theater. I can't wait to see it again. Uh, will you do us the honor and sign, uh, your, your stereophonic poster? I'd That's be delighted. Behind it. All right, if you take one of the markers, pick your color. Okay. There we go. Wonderful. Daniel Locken, uh, best director of a play. Congratulations. Thanks, Really, really incredible. Appreciate it. Thank you.